Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Friday Night Smackdown, the first episode of the Universe Mode. Well, here, co here comes the first two contenders of our first match of the night. The WWE Tag Team Champions, the Usos. And those models look really, really good. Pounds, the WWE Tag Team Champions, Jimmy and Jay, the Usos. I'm making their way to the ring. The ring. <laughs> the wing. Um, <clears throat> Xavier and Kofi Kingston with pancakes. I love pancakes. Pancakes are great. Now, if these two come in this match, this will put. And their opponents at a combined weight of 417 pounds. Xavier Woods and Kofi Kingston, the New Day. Now, as I was saying before, I was interrupted. If these two come in this match, that will put them on the path for a match against Jimmy and Jey Uso later on for those two championship belts that the Usos currently hold. Surprisingly, an Uso chant breaking out here in SmackDown. I think they're chanting Uso. Oh, and Xavier, his legs went out from under him. Kicking the back there at the midsection of Xavier. Another one, and Jay just stomping or attempting to. Xavier with a nice bulldog. And a headbutt there to Jay Uso there from Xavier Woods. Making a tag to Kofi. Kofi getting a running clothesline. I think Jay was trying to make the clothesline to Jimmy. Some sharp kicks there from Kofi. Nice reversal there from Jay. And, uh, DDT there to Kofi. <clears throat> now you've got to be thinking that, you know, the New Day, former tag team champions, they want this match to be won. Because then it gives them the opportunity later on at the pay-per-view. I think it's Backlash coming up next. Um, at Backlash to take the championships back. Now these two teams have had a hell, hell of a history over the last few years. Especially during the pandemic era. And Snake Eyes there from Jey Uso. So... You know, this is why they're not going easy on each other. And nor should they. Kofi making the tag back to Xavier. Chop there to Xavier. And a slam. Kick. And another kick. And an elbow to the midsection. In the midsection of G. Taking them back to the corner. Into their corner. That's not where Xavier Woods wants to be. That's exactly what he wants to do. Reversal wrist to the face. Now making a tag back to Kofi. Jimmy now getting it. And a combo there from Kofi. And a splash. Both of these teams have so much history with each other. And a lovely leg drop from the top turnbuckle there from Kofi, but that must have probably done some damage to him. Signature touch. From Kofi. To Jimmy. Jimmy now in the corner. Jimmy falls. Ooh. Tag there from Kofi to Xavier going for a double team. 
wow. Did you see that there? Xavier looked right at Jay. And that did nothing but piss him off. And Jay managing to save the count there. I don't think that was looking good for Jimmy there. You've got to think as well. What's Roman thinking of them right now? Roman will not be pleased if the tribal chief is not happy. Oh. Vintage Uso super kick to the face. Is that enough to put Xavier away? Jimmy dragging him to the middle there, trying to get him away from the rope breaks. But has he wasted too much time? One, two, on oh, Kofi. Kofi with the save. Now it's all breaking down here. Kofi throwing it outside the ring. Wow, uppercut there. It's not looking good here for Xavier Woods. Kofi is back up. Thanks for getting in hard cam there, Kofi. Great ring awareness. <laughs> and a nice... Oh. Hot tag made. Hot tag made to Jay. Xavier telling him to bring it. And that is what it looks like Jay's going to do. Throwing him outside the ring. He brought it. Oh, I think Kofi got in the way there to stop him from doing the, the splash. Kick to the gut. And a nice kick to the face there, right to G. Now, count outs are on. My God. These two men, all four of them, don't like each other. And there's that DDT to the outside. Is this going to lead to a double count out? These two just going back and forth. <laughs> now here comes Jimmy. No, oh, both men going for it. Oh my god. Is this going to lead to a count out? Oh no. Jay just broke the count. He could have saved it for himself. Stunner off the rope onto the floor. Landing on Jay. This match is just broken into pandemonium here at ringside. Oh, a 3D burst on Xavier right open. That's been a really good contest here. I don't think Kofi really knows what to do. Jay just keeps breaking up that count. Where's that Jimmy? I've now lost track of who's who. This match has been all over the place since the get-go. Oh! Oh, no! Jay? Jimmy? I'm trying to keep an eye on the health bar here. Who is... What Uso is that? I think it's... I think it's Jay. Or is it Jimmy? Can't tell anymore. I believe it is Jay. Yeah, it's Jay. Both men busted open in the opening contest here. Nice double flapjack. And it looks like Kofi's going for his finishing maneuver. Trouble in Paradise connects. One, two, and a break up. Oh my god, this has been great so far. This has been a great match. From all four men into the turnbuckle there. Now the Usos going for it. Oh, this is not going to be good. So it's just going to be a headbutt. Diving headbutt to the leg of Kofi. Both teams have been actually really good this month. Well, this ain't WWE 2K20. 
Oh. Oh, God. <laughs> Go free. Did not like that. Jimmy may be wanting to make a tag here. Or do that. That works too. Xavier isolated in the Usos corner once again. Now in the turnbuckle there. Back to the double team here from the Usos. And sink super kick. Big splash. Will he go for the pin? And he's going for the pin. However, he's closer to exit. Ah, uh, well, we knew that was going to happen. And there goes Kofi. Looks like Kofi's on the outside. Well. Just, what are you doing? Is it going for it? I'd have pinned him after that. Is it going for it? G. Oh, and he misses. Kofi and Jimmy fighting here on the outside. At ringside. Can't see what's going on, but you can hear it. And a hot tag. Xavier's not seen it yet. And Xavier just... Okay. Can the New Day do it? Can the New Day beat the champions? The blood all over... Xavier Woods face Wow Come on pin him Kofi Go for the pin Pin him Kofi go Oh is he going to finish him off with trouble in paradise What are you doing Kofi Oh, now both the Usos are burst open. Back to this manoeuvre. Knee in the face. Jay still on the outside. Eat defeat. Wasted too much time. And they do it. Wow. Yeah, I'd be excited too. What a hell of a match. <laughs> and here comes the semi main event and the women's champion here on SmackDown. The daughter of Ric Flair. Charlotte Flair. With the gold. And she waits for this woman to make it to the ring. Both these women with a history over gold. And here's Sasha Banks. Both of these women, hell of a history. The women's championship originally started with a triple threat with these two women and Becky Lynch at Wrestlemania a few years ago retiring the old ugly Divas Championship and what a hell of a match it was DDT right at the gate there we go, come on Sasha Sasha with a flurry of offense and a splash right at the beginning can the Queen come back? Wow, Sasha absolutely taking it to her. Jesus.
I don't think Charlotte Flair was expecting an offense like this from the boss. Knees to the back. <coughs> well, Charlotte finally reversed it. And a fireman's carry. And an ST. Uh, I don't even know what that move's called. STO. Punched in the face of Charlotte. Sasha, even. Charlotte now attacking the legs. Is this a strategy to weaken the legs so she can go for a figure f eight? But again, Sasha with a pin. One. And a kick out. She'll need to do more damage than that to take Charlotte Flair down. And a neck breaker. Oh! Going low. The ref never seen that. I mean... I'd be surprised if the ref seen it. Oh, and a big boot. One, two, and Sasha kicks out at two. It just goes to show you how strong Charlotte Flair is. Done probably less damage to Sasha Banks, and there we go. Figure eight. But will Sasha get out of it? it looks like it's locked in tight. The bridge is normally better than that, though. Ref in the way of the shot. But Sasha not only breaks out, but floats. <laughs> and a kick to the gut, flooring the champion. Is Sasha calling for it? Come for the comeback. Drop kick. I thought she was setting up for the bank statement. Is she going for it here? Bank statement! Into the rope, so! Oh. Going for the pin. One, two, and another kick out there from the champion. Charlotte Flair. That's the reason why she is the top woman in the women's division. 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 There we go. But Sasha not going easy. And a splash in Sa and Sasha gets nothing but knees. And back to the same move from earlier. Sasha manages to get up rather quickly. And a suplex there from Charlotte Flair. Now this is what Charlotte Flair is known for doing, she will control the rest of this match back to the figure eight leg lock. Is this the end for Sasha? Was that offense all for nothing? Locked in there, the referee not getting it in the way of the camera shot. Well done ref, but again, Sasha, showing how resilient she is, two figure eight leg locks, Managed to get out of both. So this is still anybody's game. Could go either way. Remember, it's a non-title match, so the belt is not on the line. And a hurricane runner from Sasha Banks. Two. Ooh, close, but no cigar. Sasha showing her frustration there with the referee. Now, Sasha, I would say, has had more offense the whole match, but the power of Charlotte Flair, I would say, is probably the bigger threat. And another bank statement, and again, too close to the ropes, is she? Yes. Maj, surprised the referee could even see that. And again, it's nothing but knees. Oh, and a slap and a punch. <laughs> My god, knees. Knees to the midsection of the boss. 
Charlotte going to the floor, the top. Calling for Sasha to get up. And a splash. Look at the impact to that. And the kick again. Ooh. Ooh. Is this the end? Is this the end for Sasha tonight? One, two, three. Charlotte Flair beats Sasha Banks, sending her to the back of the line. Here is your winner, Charlotte Flair. And that is why she is the champion. And our main event tonight, the Celtic Warrior will go up against this man, the Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. <clears throat> And, oh, okay. Roman Reigns flanked by every member of the Bloodline. Things are not looking good for Sheamus tonight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Pensacola, Florida. Weighing in at 265 pounds. The World Heavyweight Champion, Roman Did I say Universal Champion? I uh, thank you. I know I know I, do, I know I said the Universal Champion. What I meant was the new World Heavyweight Champion. My bad. Look how good he looks with a big big old belt. Bring that back. And there it is, the big gold belt. The bloodline looking on as the champion gets in his yard. Now, Sheamus will be no slouch. Sheamus is a former world ch heavyweight champion himself. Multi world heavyweight champ, multi time world heavyweight champion, I should say. And here he is. And his opponent from Dublin, Ireland, weighing in at 267 pounds, the Celtic Warrior, Sheamus. The Celtic Warrior will not hold back against Roman Reigns. If you think that Sheamus is going to lie down and take it tonight, then I've got another thing coming for you, ladies and gentlemen. Sheamus will not back down from Roman Reigns. This is going to be bloody and both men are going to leave their mark on each other. <clears throat> It'll be Bro Kick versus the Spear. And again, well, on the early set, a nice <laughs> suplex there from Sheamus at the beginning. And is this a Alabama slam right out of the gate? Two big moves to the big dog. And Roman then reverses it with a suplex of his own. <clears throat> now, both of these men are not well liked by the Universal the WWE Universal, <laughs> I was about to say the Universal, um, but I do believe they hate Roman more. But we'll see Roman taking it to Sheamus with punches, but you don't want to get in a slugfest with the Celtic Warrior, because if there's one person yeah, that can give them out as good as he gets, it's Sheamus. Sheamus for a nice reverse DDT there. Punch to the face of Roman and a nice STO. 
Sheamus now grabbing Roman and look at the strength of him. Just throwing. Roman Reigns away like a piece of meat. And he's splash back at Roman on his back. And Roman manages to just shake it off with a clothesline. As I said, these men will not hold back. To the outside of the ring, will the big dog follow? And he does. Rolls to the outside of the ring, getting Sheamus back up on his feet. And a nice suplex on the outside. And just putting the back ahead, back of the head of Sheamus into the outside. Now big punches. Nice uppercut. Roman now taking Sheamus to the apron. Didn't know what he was doing there. Sheamus managed to get out. And Roman wants to win this thing, so he's put them back into the ring. But Oh, and a Superman punch! Is that enough to put Sheamus away? One, two, ah, no. Roman with utter disbelief there. Just to show you that Sheamus... Sheamus will not go away quietly. And a nice uppercut there. And an axe to the face. And another Alabama slam. Razor's Edge! He's going for the cover. One, two, oh! Sheamus showing frustration here. Sheamus knows more damage is me. And the bro kick! Is that enough to put the world champion away? One, two! Oh! oh ho, 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 ho. Sheamus thinks he got a three. Oh, and a kick. Sheamus is not in a good mood now. And Roman manages to reverse it. Sheamus puts him into a turnbuckle. Punch. Oh, and a wrist in the face. And another one for good measure. A kick to the midsection. Another kick. Oh, both of these men just slugging each other now. Roman going for a reverse netbreaker. This match has been pretty even so far. But I'd say Roman has had the slight edge. And Roman just gets down, allowing Sheamus to get the advantage. And uh, Snake Eyes into the turnbuckle. Now, oh! Oh, Roman reverses it. My god, this has just been a slugfest! Oh! Guillotine! Roman with the guillotine! Is that enough to put Sheamus away? I think Seamus tr is trying to get to the ropes. Is that enough? Oh, I don't think... I don't think that was enough. Was that enough? Did it... Oh! Seamus! Show him why he is a multi-time champion himself. But I think Roman's calling for it. Is Roman going for another one? And another one! Will Sheamus tap? Come on. Oh, and a rope break saves it. Wow. And Roman again going for a submission. And Sheamus has no choice but to tap out. And. <laughs> what happened at the end there? Why did you. Jason get thrown in the ring. <laughs> Sheamus with a valiant effort, but not enough to put the big dog away. Sheamus with utter de defeat in his eyes. 
Wait a minute. What is going on here? What? Oh my god. At a combined weight of 910 pounds. Hollywood Hogan, Scott Hall, and Kevin Nash. The NWO. What? No way. The bloodline is in shock. The New World Order is here! Scott Hall just going up. I think the bloodline are leaving. What does this mean for the bloodline? What happens next?